But I treat them as other people. I do not other treat people them like not related to you. Yes. Okay, like strangers. No. Okay. No, like friends. Good friends. Okay. Like acquaintances. Yeah. I good understand that. Friends that fucked and made me. I understand that. Yeah, basically, I just don't respect them anymore. <laughs> you know what, Mom and Dad? You're just like good friends that fucked and made me. <laughs> <laughs> so that's like a that's like a fucking deep cut insult. <laughs> Like, you're not parents to me. You just fucked it happened. I just happened to be there. See, those are the kind of uh, <laughs> things that I love to say. Like, I'm just using you for my friendship, for your friendship. <laughs> yeah. Like well, That's what you've been telling me for the last fucking 15 years. <laughs> people people get really, like, offended by that. Really? Yeah. Like, I've but, said But, like, that's the whole point, though. Is, yeah. like, you like being around these people because you're friends with them. Yeah. That's the point. So I'm using them for their, for fr- their friendship. Yeah, and they just like ah, the optics are just terrible on that. I'm like, because well, they because they, they, they don't like the words using you. Yeah, I mean it'd be like I'm using you to help get me up on this wooden plank because yeah I am uh, I am unable to do that, and that's a helping manner. It's a friendly thing to do, but then. You know, you say that for their friendship, and they're like, you fucker. Yeah, like, all of a sudden, it changes how they interpret that. Yeah, it's like, no, guys, I'm talking about that we're friends. We're good friends that I use for laughter. I use for friendship. Yeah, I use you for your, your friendship. It just rubs people the wrong way for some reason. I don't know. I don't get it. I don't know, man. People are crazy. Well, they just don't, they just don't get your joke, I guess. Yeah, they just you know they just get so offended by you know being my friend apparently. But yeah, any any time I can think of something like that where it sounds awful but it's actually very nice, that's that's that gives me a nice chubby. I know. Yeah, that's a Love very it. yeah. Well, that's a that's a very you thing, I think. It's like a it's like a backhanded compliment, but yeah. you know, it's actually just all nice and I just like saying things weird because it's funny here. <laughs> Life's too short to be oh, a chode. <laughs> well life is a chode. It's too short. <laughs> short and chubby. Yeah, short and chubby. <laughs> Just you go through the Loads miasma. Loads on impact, just like <laughs> yeah, yeah, just like that it makes that sound too. Um, I would like to add to the previous conversation. Um, I don't entertain when my mom asks me to do something because I don't want her to think she can do it again. That's fair enough. That's the a biggest good, thing good, is yeah. when she would ask me questions about her iPad, and then I say, "You are fifty-seven. Google it. Google it. See, I'll help to a point, but then I'll just say, "I'm not going to help you anymore. Google it." But like, if they're if it's one thing, if it's like one quick question, but yeah. if it's that question, and then three days later, it's the same question. Learn it yeah. yourself. Yeah. It's like Taylor's dad constantly asking how to add a contact in his phone. Yeah. It's like, just just look it up or do The first it. time? Okay. The second time? All right. Just look around and the figure time, it out. Oh, my God. But that's the thing but that's the thing with like a lot of that technology stuff. Like I don't inherently know how to do that. I just look at stuff and then like through... Figure it out. Like deductive reasoning, you can like see like, oh, here's how you do that. You know? Yeah. Like I don't I don't use Apple products, but like you can figure it figure out. it out. Yeah. I don't like Apple products. Yeah, I don't but know. I can I like figure them. them out if uh, you know, if something if someone comes up to me. Mainly it's the old ladies at work. Mm-hmm. They'll come up and they'll be like, William, my computer doesn't work and you know what the fuck I always do? The same thing you should always do. You fucking, uh, you turn it off and you turn it back on and then, hey, things all work. Yeah. But then as soon as they're done with that, they immediately forget what they just did. And they never think to do that thing ever again if the same situation arises. Yep. I've, 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 
<laughs> done this thing like three or four times. Yeah, like that knowledge for this person. They watch over my shoulders, and they even say the words, "I'm going to watch so that I know what you do." Yeah, and then they don't. And then I restart and all that, and then they're like, "William, it's doing that thing again." I'm like, "All right, well, you watched me, so do the thing." Oh, Jesus Christ! I'm watching you. I just want to give friend. you a hug. Get off my friend. I can do it. <laughs> and that is how Leon died. <laughs> and he never saved the girl. <laughs> that was, yeah. I'll admit that was a very stupid death on my part, but whatever. I, I could have done better at that. Yeah. Uh, literally, all I do in my job is not all, but a big thing with hearing aids, like a question I have to ask every time is. Do you want them to be able to connect to your phone? That was my you, my go-to question at first. My question now is, do you have a cell phone? Yeah. Then they say yes or no. If they say yes, you say, what kind of cell phone? If they don't know, it doesn't matter. Yeah, because they're not going to be able to do it anymore. Yeah, they're not going to be able to figure it out. Yeah. If you don't know the model of your cell phone, I mean, I still talk about it, but I'm like, off. that's your indicator. <laughs> this is not something for you. Yeah. Because, yeah, if you're you're too ignorant of your own technology, yes. then it's not going to be useful. Because, yeah, if you ask them, do you want it to connect to your phone? Yes. They will 100% of the time say yes. Yes, exactly. And then they'll never use the technology. Exactly. Because they don't know how. Exactly. And then they'll cry the one time that something pops up on their phone and says... Do you want hearing aids to do this thing? Yes or no? And then they call and they're like, What the fuck? <laughs> I don't know what they're saying. What's happening? The hearing aids Voices are, are trying, trying to happen. hack into my phone. Are you trying to get my credit card information? Yeah. I've How about I put a $5 bill oh my God, in I'm an awful. envelope? Awful. <laughs> no, it was $10, right? Frustrating. Oh, $10, yeah. And then I asked them at the evaluation every single time. Um, I used to just like do it when they came in. We'd download the app and everything, pair them together. And then now I say, I'm going to give you the name of an app. Your homework is to go home and download, download it, it before you come. Yeah. You come and you don't have it downloaded. We're not doing You'll it. have to come back. Because... Yeah. I learned the hard way through beating my head against concrete after 10 million times of them showing up and then me, me being like, oh, you have to put in your password. What's my, What's my password? password? And then they go, well, what's my password? I don't know. You're the you, one who you're made You're the it. one that knows it, bitch. My dead husband made it. I don't know the password. It died with him. Well, then I guess you're not gonna have that was it's been 84 years <laughs> yeah I I try to make sure Oops. that the people that I'm dealing with are as independent as possible with them and if they require me to do more than one thing that might be a little technical exactly. or maybe they overlooked then I stop helping because I know it's just going to cause me more problems more in the future English. yeah that's exactly. why I don't teach people my robotic stuff unless they're young. Which sucks, but it does kind of suck to be ageist in that, but like I'm the exact same way. Yeah. Sorry. Like, like Tim comes up to me, he's 60 or 59, he's, he's real close to 60. And you know, he's got, he just got his knee replaced and all that. And he comes up and he's like, do you know how to do this on your phone? All the time to me, so I know he's not a great like technology person. And I will like I'll be doing something on the robot. He'll be like, "So how do you do this on the robot?" And I'm like, "Well, I'm not supposed to teach you, so I'm not going to." Yeah. Yeah. Right. And then uh, you know, someone else will come up, like Taylor. She's 20. She'll be 21 on Sunday this week. She's a kid. She knows technology. So, you know, when she comes up, I'll be like, oh, yeah, you just do this, this, and this. And she gets it. Yeah. Like, you can see the spark. Yeah. The, like, the, the, you, the, you, you don't even have to, like, see a spark in it. It's just an understanding. Yeah. Like, they're not just nodding and going. Yeah. 
looking at it, looking glazed eyed at the screen, being like, I have no clue what you just did. You did it too What's, fast. What did you hit six buttons in a configuration? What did what was the one that Marvin did the other day? Wasn't there one that Marvin did at your work, Melissa? Starving Marvin. He always does shit. I know, but there was a good one the other day, wasn't there? There always is good shit. <laughs> one of the best ones was he couldn't figure out how to bold something. Oh, what was that one? It was definitely in Microsoft Word. Because I remember him being like, in Microsoft Office Word, and I'm like, We're all, this is already done. I don't care what the question is. Off to a bad start with that one, Marvin. What was it? It was something hilarious. Jesus Christ, how many fucking dudes are there? There's too many. Almost 30 in this area? Too many. Oh, I know what it was. We have so we have online forms like intake forms, send them out oh, to patients yeah. by yeah, email, yeah, yeah. and this they like fill this them out one. online, right? Submit them online. Then you don't have to fucking waste paper and shit. Yeah. Older people cannot fathom that. Though. No. And his, he goes. So how on Microsoft Office Word? How? Like, there's this box when you print it off. Like, how would they check it? If online they're pressing it to check it, how, if you're printing it, how would they check it? And I'm like, what? And he's like, the box, like, if, how would you check it? I'm like, what? So, is he trying to... Is he trying to say that like people people are going to print off this screen and then know. like bring it in? He can't even print it. Like it's in yeah, like, a, like it's it it's in like an encrypted well, you company can, runs this thing. Yeah, okay? I'm just saying like the the way you could do that would be print screen. Print screen. Right. And then print but, it. But like who's doing that? Apparently him. Because he seems to He's have that true. idea. Because, yeah, then how would you check it? Well, then you take a pen and you go... You, you put a, a check pen, mark. You take a pen. It is now in a tangible medium for you to mark up with a writing implement. No. Yeah, which, you know, if that's where you want to go, you can go and do that. I, would, I wouldn't suggest it. I'd just hit the button. But Yeah, well, he's stupid. He thought that, like, oh, yeah, you can write on a piece of paper... How does how do you transfer things onto the paper? Like I want to put the check mark. You could even literally click the check mark, and then print screen, because then it'll be it'll have the check mark yeah, already right. in it. Yeah, yeah. There's so many things he could do. The options are limitless. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, maybe that's what he wanted to hear from you. How do you spell kaleidoscope? Probably that's what he wanted to. There is one another one where he's. Like, said shit like that I don't know he's had some funny ones I, I, I don't know how to spell kaleidoscope so uh, I could try but I don't care I would assume it's collide and then scope no there's the E-L K A L E I D O S E O P E put it up on screen kaleidoscope put it up on screen is she correct Make it right if it's wrong. That was a <laughs> that was a, a a Dane Cook bit, like on Crank Anchors or something like that. He was doing like an on like a on phone trivia game show or something, and that was just one of them. He was like, "Spell the word kaleidoscope," and the guy's just like, "Oh, you got me there." Jesus Christ, you got this, Taylor. I mean, I don't know how to spell it, so but I've never been a great um, speller. My, uh, not, I've not been a good spellist. My uh, my uh, literature, my literary uh, achievements are uh, very slim. I can I can describe things very well mm -hmm. when it comes to food and drinks and stuff. Sure. Um, when I'm trying to describe a vista or something like that, I tend to use the words big ass. Mm hmm. Big that ass. was that is a big ass hill. It's a big ass bitch, bitch. It's a big ass hill next to a big ass watering hole, and there's this big ass girl who's got a big ass big sitting ass. on a big ass chair. She's a bitch, bitch. ass. 
Are you picturing anybody in particular when you say this? Um, the uh, the factory. Factory slot? Yeah. Oh. Just got big ass. <laughs> That, that sapphire not, thing, it was probably going to be hot. Yeah. Should take burn damage for that. How come he steps in the thing and doesn't... <laughs> Old men powers. He knows to step between. God damn it. I'm getting hit a lot on this. Kaleidoscope. I think you're right. But I don't know. You might be right. I, think I don't think that it's spelled with a ca cash sign. It is. <laughs> the cash sign. <laughs> One of my coworkers, we have to like initial everything all the time. Her initials are TS. And every time I would write it, like after like a year of working there, every time I would write it, I would just do this. Now she does it. Like for the last like six years, she's just every time she initials you, something, it's that. you were bullying her into changing like, I her I think initials. it's so funny, and I don't know why. And then sometimes if I'm just being an asshole, it's about, I'll do like MM, and if I'm just being an asshole, I'll just be like, <laughs> scribble. <laughs> um, wouldn't yours be MB? No, because well, now I could do it. Before there was a big thing of um, this receptionist names. that we had hired for a while. Her name was But then she got married, and it was my name is Judge. Oh, okay. I had been there way longer than her, but then she's but she like, the best. she's like, I want to write MM, and I was like, well, fine, and I'll just write MB. I don't care. Then she gets married the next week. So then she's, she's now. My name is Judge. And I'm like, well, you can't have both. You have to pick one. Pick one. So she chose MB and you chose MM. She's gone now. Oh. Yeah, she's Bye, she's dead to them now. Oh, good. Bye, beach. Yeah, mine's a uh, WW. W, w. Whenever I had to put it on, like, uh, oh, yeah, that's a hard one too. It'd just be yeah, a bunch just, of swiggles too. Yeah. Whenever, uh, whenever I had to do stuff, I would always put uh, WW2 because that's good. That's pretty good. <laughs> because I was on second shift, so I did WW2, uh, and then now I'm on first shift, so WW1. You went back to World War. Yeah, I went. I went to World War One. My uh, my numbers at the work are seven forty seven, like the plane. Yeah. So yeah, the unfortunately, plane. mine's not seven thirty seven, which are the planes that were uh, used in World War One. <laughs> what about the seven eighty seven? Weren't those the ones that they grounded for a while? 787? Or 777? Yeah, it's someone. The big ones? It's one of the seven. Yeah, the new Boeings. Yeah. yeah. Those got grounded for a hot night. Remember when everyone was really freaking out about the Boeings? Yeah, we were just talking about that Malaysian air where the where it just well, cause the ocean. Well, because you were telling me about the guy that... Oh, no, that was the same thing. Yeah, the guy that killed himself over there, right? Yeah. And then oh, I just went nice on a plane ride, like, shortly after. Oh, because you were well, talking about... Whatever. You were talking about some old lady who was like, Well, pre-9-11, I could just walk across the border. Yeah. But well, we used to ride our bicycles to get ice cream. We would go up. to Canada, get chlamydia, <laughs> and come home. Is that Canada's main export? <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> no, it's a gonorrhea. Oh, good. The diarrhea. Ah. Uh, one of them. It's all that poo. It's one of. It's one of them. <laughs> it's all that poo teen you're eating up there. Yeah. Next time you come, we're getting that poutine place. Yes, uh, I would if like you that. Want it. That was the plan. But yeah. we're waiting for you to go there. We're not gonna go there without you. Yeah. Uh. Every single time I try to hang out with you guys, uh, something comes up. <laughs> yeah, something comes up or someone's dying. Yeah, somebody always is dying. Well, like I was well, worried I wasn't even going to be able to come this time because Anne was still not feeling great that until sucks. until like a day or two ago. Now she's just like. Was she was she harfing? 
Barfing and barfing. Barfing and barfing. <laughs> no, she was just uh, sneezing, uh, dribbling snot out of her nose. That sucks. Um, Does she have like a lot of face-to-face -face interaction at work? Yeah. Yeah. She works at Kroger. Well, yeah, but I didn't know <laughs> if, it was, if, if it was like a busy. Yeah, Kroger time. the the Richmond store is probably the busiest store in our area. But she works. What hours does she uh, work? She works from normally four until like twelve thirty in the afternoon. <sighs> that's what I thought. Well, four four a.m. to yeah, yeah that's right. What I yeah, yeah, like it's not a day shift. No, it is kind that's of day shifty. I mean, it's not. It's the same amount. You know what yeah. I mean. You know what I mean. I'm technically at work for nine hours. I no, I know, but like. It's just those hours. That would be a long time because yeah. you'd get fucking every ancient person yep. yeah, breaking that's, the that's, doors down. That's who she has to mainly deal with is the old people. Ugh. Especially on Sunday Ooh. after church gets out. I always get real angry when I go to the grocery store. At like It's like 5 o'clock or something. And, and it's all these decrepit people and they're like, which, which? Rice should I get? <laughs> and you're like, you have had all fucking day to do this. And you come. You come now. Yeah. I yeah. had to go see Gosh. God. <laughs> I had to burrow I had to go myself to that, in God's pussy. I had to go to that God place, whatever it's called. God, bitch. What if, uh, what if God was real and he came down and he's like... Uh, he, he tells everyone, you know, that he loves them and all that. And he's all absolved of all your sins and all that. And then he's like, oh, yeah, and it's pronounced Jod. And then he just <laughs> he just disappears. <laughs> all these years. I'd be like, all right. <laughs> I'd be like, well, well, I guess worth I'm a convert, man. <laughs> Sign me. I guess, I guess Jod is real. <laughs> Like, I picture he says all this thing, and then he's in the sky, and then he, like, fades away, and then for a brief second, he comes back, and he's just, oh, yeah, it's pronounced Jod, and then just fades away again. <laughs> and then, and then there's gonna be, like, like, the, there's gonna be a splintering of it, where one person misheard it, and he's like, no, he said Jode, he said it was Jode. Yeah. This is your new logo. For what? For, for life? You. Yeah, yeah, your life. Yes. Oh, I tricked when you shot me in the head. Oh, God, that fucking hurt. God, that really hurt. Do you think people would give up on, on God if his name was John? No. No, I don't think they would. Yeah, I don't think they would. Especially, especially if like he, uh, he if came he, back. If, if he manifested, then yeah. Oh, that was a fair move. That was fair. That was very fair. Yeah, that's okay. You, th you thought you got it, but you didn't, and then he. I had confidence. Gotcha. I had confidence, but yeah, it didn't didn't pan out the way I wanted. But that's okay. Well, yeah, I think yeah, if he definitely manifested. If he manifested, then yeah, people yeah, would. People I think, would definitely start believing again. It would. Uh, John's this pussy. Is his logo. <laughs> John's pussy. Pussy. There we have it. Yeah, if he if I'm he manifested, I'm done creating for the night. It's just those. <laughs> yeah, he. I think that would reinstate people's fervor. I think. Yeah. Or like it would reinforce it for sure. It would probably also like ruin a whole bunch of other people who thought like Jod was uh, all these other different things, but it's just like some white guy. <laughs> He's not even. Yeah, and I, and I think it'd be funny if he looked like fucking Will Arnett just because. Yeah. <laughs> He's like a really tan Will Arnett for some reason. <laughs> He's just like, yeah, all your religions are stupid and they're wrong. This is. I'm, he would I'm say John. like I can hear him saying that. Yeah. Honestly, I could. All your religions are stupid and wrong. Stop doing that. Also, my name is Jod. Also, it's Jod. And all those people who keep taking your money for private jets, stop giving it to them. Yeah, don't. I'm not, I'm not paying. I'm not getting paid to absolve your sins. <laughs> you can't. I should be getting that money. <laughs> not them. And then all those people are just like. Shit. 
Yeah. And then all those people who didn't believe in like a god or anything like that would just be so angry. That mean they I, wrong. I don't know. I don't know if I'd be angry. I think it'd just be a sense of like. I mean, those religious people who are not religious in terms of like, like a god. Right. Well, I mean, you know, I don't know. That's a weird. It's a weird thing. I don't know. Yeah. I think I think it'd be weird if it were like. Um, like if it confirmed like their version of God, where he's like, you know, God loves guns and not dead babies and blah blah blah, you know. That's like, yeah. That's the version of God that I'd be like, all right, this guy sucks. Like, this is sick. Like he's dumb. <laughs> I'm going into graphic design. <laughs> there you go. Yeah, offer graphic design uh, uh, like services and be like, I have an iPad. <laughs> <laughs> She'd be like, what's her face trying to do start a photo business with her iPhone? Oh my god, that was awesome. <laughs> my friend, you've met Becky, my friend Becky, um, has this not so sister in law. Crazy, crazy, ex, crazy. Ex sister in law. Yes. And yeah, just she's wild. the she's bare wild. minimum that you need to know is that she had no money, so she decided she was going to start a photography business. She didn't have a camera. She was going to use her iPhone or your phone. Whichever one's better. Whichever one was better. She had no clients. And she got very angry all the time on social media that no one was booking her. So, well, why would you? You can get your friend to do the same damn thing for free. You can Maybe. use a fucking self-timer. Yeah, you can use a timer. You could Wild. get your friend to do it for free. She could start doing like OnlyFans. <laughs> With that, she did. Oh, good. she did. Oh, good. Why did you give me TMP? Did she? Did she do well, or did she fail at that too? Well, she didn't show her beaver, so no, she didn't do well. Oh yeah. Mm -hmm. If you don't show your beaver, no one's gonna pay. Yeah. Yeah. Rough. I'm sorry, guys. I'm just doing lewds in the end now. That's not what the six. No, for. her whole thing was uh, weed. Like she was really into marijuana, healing people. It healed her anxiety. So well, now she's got so OCD. So she was mess. the sexy bud tender. Or HD, or no ADHD mess. That's what she's called. She's not. No. 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 She's not very sexy at all. We talking like uh, you, gross, I'll, I'll or just like? Her. I'll find her. Yeah, whatever. I'll find her, and you can make your own. Yeah, okay. I, I think I, I think you're gonna be a fan, really. I'm you gotta not find gonna like be a, a good fan. picture that so. actually looks like her, you know? Yeah, I don't think you're gonna be a fan, though. Yeah, I'll, I'll let you know immediately, too. <laughs> I know you will. Like, oh shit, that girl is hot! Or, eww. Something like that. I don't know. Is, uh, is ah! still doing her thing? Probably. I haven't. I haven't looked. Yeah, no, <laughs> me neither. No clue. Egg. Got a lot of fish in here. And it's gonna eat raw, I guess. God. From what I saw on her Twitter last time, all her oh, posts. She tweeting? Yeah, she tweets before she does her OnlyFans stuff. Oh. So all she ever tweeted was, I, I totally forgot that I have social media. Here's here's some OnlyFans pics that I did. That, yeah. Here's um, a new set of photos. It's been a hot minute. That's the. The closest selfie I can find that generally represents her. She looks tired. Like the world is really beating her down. She's got two kids most of the time, right? Two kids? Two yes. kids. Two kids, yeah. To buy me flowers. There, there's gotta be a better picture somewhere. It's, it's kind of dummy. Go ahead now. All right, Billy. We're about at the end of our episode time. What should we do? Should we do another one? It's kind of early. It's earlier than I thought, but it's up to you. Yeah, let's do one more. All right, next time at Chips and Chips, I'm going to keep going. Wow! Oh,
Mm-hmm.